Let's learn about custom settings in Salesforce. You go to setup in the quick find box. Type custom settings. So these are uh, this is the custom settings screen. If you want to create a new custom setting, click new here. Um, you get a new information here, right here. Use custom metadata type uh, or for app configuration. There's an alternative to custom settings, custom metadata, but uh, the main difference is you can deploy custom metadata with change sets. Um, so, but uh, custom setting you have to uh, manually um, upload. If you are thinking of using list of custom settings, consider using custom metadata type instead. Unlike custom settings, you can migrate records of custom metadata type using packages or metadata API tools. You can enable list custom setting on, on schema setting page in setup. So that's the information you have. Let's say label test is a custom. This is the object name, uh, also we test. Um, uh, you can have, uh, this is setting type is hierarchy is disabled right now. Uh, visibility of custom query can be set only in developer sandbox or scratch up. The visibility of custom setting affects object released in manage packages, protected custom settings are not accessible by Cypress Resort, but public custom settings are. So this is a description. This is how you create a custom setting. So you can see API name test underscore underscore E, uh, a C. So this is a test label. Um, you can add custom fields to custom settings. Um, let's create a new custom field. Uh, text. Put uh, city length. Is pretty much like adding a field for any other object. You can make it unique as well. You can save and uh, new or save. So this custom setting has fields, has a field. You can add multiple. So this is how you create a custom setting. 